Hi guys, uh, just done a little bit of an intro for you at the beginning after this. So if you, I'd love you to see the video. Um, hopefully there's some funny bits in it and it'll give you an idea um, of the, the day and a half that we had um, from Bonus Solway to Munkill and then down to a little bit into Carlisle where we had to uh, basically call it a day. Anyway, watch the next bit of me rabbiting on and then, uh, then the, the video follows from there. All right. Catch you later. Ouch. Hi guys. My career. Well, <coughs> I've got some news for you, unfortunately, um, regarding the walk. Um, basically, Dave and I set off with obviously good intentions of doing the whole walk. Um, but unfortunately, along the way, uh, my fitness levels just weren't up to the kind of terrain, even though it was quite flat, to be honest with you, the, the first day. Uh, and the heat and basically carrying that sort of weight on, on my back. Um, and as I kind of put in the video, you know, at certain points, I just literally, totally, utterly gone. I think I must have got some form of blooming... Um, heat stroke or something because I was literally shaking, I was floored. Uh, I knew I had to push on, but there was one point um, in the video where I just, uh, I couldn't, I, I nearly just had to stop, put my rucksack down. But the problem is when you do that, obviously you want to pick it up and load it back up. So what I would say is if you're going to do this walk, um, really, really think about your weight. There was a lot of people on the walk who just only had small little rucksacks, tiny ones, <clears throat> and they were just doing parts of the wall um, which were um, sort of on view, because it's not on view for quite a while, um, and they were just doing B&Bs, bed and breakfast and everything. Um, anyway, cut to the chase. So I just want to really apologise and say to everybody out there, you know, obviously you've helped us massively with the... Um, with the uh, sponsorship here um it's all the other way around but um and online uh for trinity um and i know that i me and dave it wasn't dave at all it was me um i just i just when we got back to the campsite and we set up tent i just had a chat with him and just knew that it wasn't going to be possible at all to to do tomorrow in the heat I mean, we, we got back sort of later on, um, on the Saturday evening, um, and I, I, I knew. So basically what we tried to do is we tried to walk into Carlisle a little bit from the campsite, but we had to get a taxi in the end and just get back and get back to the train station and get home. And I'm still worn out now, still shaky and it's just, I won't go on about that, I'm not going to go. The heat is just, was just unbelievable. Um, don't underestimate that walk. I mean, that is a tough walk. There's somebody on YouTube that says that um, how difficult the walk uh, for older people and stuff, and it's not too bad, but it's, bloody hell, it's it's tough going. But I suppose we... I. I don't know, maybe we should have done that. We should have stopped earlier on that day uh, because I was just, by the time it got got to the campsite, I was gone and then we kipped over. And then the other chap that's in the video, Pete, really good lad. Again, he set off on the morning we did um, and he he didn't carry it on and he's a flipping army medic. Uh, he, he just finished, he, he sort of called it a day. It was too much for him as well. So anyway, so that's it. I just wanted to say, I hope you guys are all right with the money that, that you've given for the subscriptions and the online. Uh, we did our best, or I did my best. Dave would have carried on, but he wouldn't go without me, which is, you know, that's what it's all about, isn't it? So I uh, just want to say massive thanks. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, you know, um, I, feel, I feel like I've let the team down to be honest with you but literally there was no way at all I could go carry on I was just absolutely exhausted so 
enough of that uh, as i said please put any comments below um just you know letting us know what your kind of thoughts are but otherwise we're just going to crack on and, and get the money in we've done our best we did what did we do it's about 10 miles it's nothing is it i know but in that in that extreme hotness and with the rucksacks on i was just unbelievable um so that's it really guys um much love to you all and thanks for all your support and everything um from um lee and dave and then um, we'll catch you later bye guys how you doing well we finally made it uh, to the start of the walk um, which is on bonus on Solway how are you feeling Dave excited yeah. excited yeah we are I mean you know in all fairness it's absolutely gonna be roasting today it's about 25 degrees so um, we're we've just sort of um, put the old sun cream on and all the gear haven't we we've got everything there all the rucksacks are there ready to go so yeah, so we're at our first start of the walk and uh, the first of many videos. See you soon. Oh yeah, we're just gonna Passports. do those. We're just gonna get those stamped up now. Right guys, so we're gonna get the uh, passports stamped now. This is the Hadrian's Wall bu little bunker um, box with the stamps in. Dave's just gonna sure. uh, stick it in the right one. Yeah. Bonus and Solway. And there's the banks. About eight of these on the route, I think. Uh, there you go, guys. Is there a right, a right way up? Can you see? There we First go. First one. Right, Do centre. Bosch. Fab. Fabulous. Yeah. And then Macca's. Macca's. Yeah, Dave hasn't signed his. This, look at the state of this. Look at the state of this. Oh, you've signed yeah, yours, have you? signed it. See, Lee, Lee McGregor. <laughs> <laughs> I should have put Macca Doodle Doo. Yeah. There we go, so yeah, we're officially, officially going to go, yeah. Right guys, sorry about wobbly camera, we've officially started uh, and uh, we're now on our route to the first stop which is going to be Monk Hill. Monk Hill tonight. It's going to be about eight, what, eight miles Dave? It's not... Eight and a half miles, um, hopefully be there before 4pm, <sighs> yeah. quick shall we? Pitch the tent, some fresh clothes on and then we're heading for the pub. <laughs> 6.30. <laughs> surprise, surprise. A couple yeah. of pints of Guinness. Yeah, oh yeah, that's cool Guinness. <laughs> All right, so we'll catch with you soon. All right. This is one long road. Dave's strategy is that he's just going to keep his head down. How are you, mate? Yeah. Just face the concrete. <laughs> All right, guys, we just had a quick rest. And uh, it's mainly water is the order of the day. Isn't it, Dave? Definitely water today. Plenty of it. How are you doing, buddy? I'm getting there, man. I'm getting there. It's a warm, isn't it? Yeah. What have you got? It is warm. Guys, I don't know if you can hear us if we're on the, the audio mic on the camera. But, uh, gotta say, it's uh, a warm day. <laughs> Plenty of water. Yeah, 64. Dave's navigating as well along the roads. We're on this first stretch. Bonus on Solway to Monk Hill, which is Beaumont. Uh, not going to go over that, we've just been through that, but yeah, I met some people who were just finishing the walk and they said it was absolutely fantastic. So, uh, all good.
grass. A big pontoon bale in there. Incredible. Let's continue. Seriously hot. It's really, really uh, it's hot. It's relentless, really. Yeah, it but is. But we're plowing on through, aren't we? Lee? We're going there. Yeah. We're getting there. It's regardless. And this is the view that we've got to look forward to <laughs> going down. The long and winding road. It is a long and winding road. <laughs> but we're near, aren't we, bud? Yeah, we're getting there. Yeah. So Found another little tree. It's not Sycamore Gap. So here we are guys, we're at the Greyhound Inn, which I think Dave and I right, this coke is needed. Desperately by Lee. Desperately. Desperately. I was nearly having the first meltdown in this searing heat. I'm the, Dave had to nearly attach me to his back and, uh, yeah, but anyway, what you on there mate? Electrolyte. Electrolyte, yeah. Yeah, it's just, it, it, it I mean, that, that's, that's nothing you can do, is it? It's just, it's just searing your heart. But uh, I think Dave was in the SAS or something before. We, we in military forces, Dave. Rom are in commandos, 12 years. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Surprise me. Catering corps. <laughs> yeah, were you? You're joking. <laughs> God, right, it's all coming out now. <laughs> here we right, go. guys, uh, here we are. We're at the Greyhound Inn, and uh, we're not far off the campsite now. I think it's about, probably about another mile, so I can't tell you. This is the only time you'll probably see me having a coat. Uh, but I, I mean, yeah, you could have a pint of beer, but I, I need this. Oh, it's so good. So just a quickie, I started off very, very flat in the day. It's, it's, it's just it's just totally flat. Bearing in mind, we're going from Bonus on Solway to, um, so we're doing basically west to east. So Bonus on Solway stretches uh, to, to Beaumont, very, very flat and uh, mainly road. So for any of you hikers out there, and there's a nice little pub which we're in now called The Ground Inn. Uh, as we're in, Br are we in Bruff Sands? Bruff Sands? Burr on Sands. Burr on Sands. Yeah. Burr on Sands at the moment. So uh, we're just going to get into the campsite in a tick and uh, get the camp, get, get the camps, get the, uh, the tent set up and uh, we'll come back to you soon, mate. Goosh. Goosh. That's the camera. Right, we're just doing a, well, we're actually videoing it now, but that's where we're at now. Where Dave's finger is there, the Greyhound Inn. So how far we've got to go now? Oh, well it's, it's only down the road, isn't it? That's a track And that's today. Uh, what we've done today at the bottom, which is seven miles, nearly coming up to eight miles, the bottom, which is trying to tune into 7.61. So we're ne nearly eight miles, which really doesn't seem like a lot, Dave, does it? But given the heat and the backpacks, it's been a good old it's a, tough start. It's been I had tough. a bit of meltdown. Uh, but I'll go into that later on and do some more juicy details on it. Just having a quick stop guys, we're near Munkill now which is the first stop. Our navigator's just having a quick look, see how we're doing. And we're lost. Guys, we're just coming into. Uh, I don't know where we're coming into. Well, we're approaching Monk Hill now. Approaching Monk Hill, and this is St Michael's Church, where the picture of the statue that I've just shown you, King Edward I, is buried in here. 
a long time ago. How long, Dave? 1307 after the Thirteen... losing his life in battle uh, in the campaign to capture Robert the Bruce. That's our local historian. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Just, uh, just so we put that on for you. Right, guys. I just had to. Uh, had the coke. <laughs> yeah, doing really well. Nearly there. Dave's just going to go through like a, a little uh, gate. Takes us across the way. Give us a kiss, David. Come on. He's bottled out. What do you want a kiss for? It's a kissing gate, isn't it? All oh, right, I'm with you. Oh, for God's sake. The heat's got to him. Uh, yeah. I've just been stung by a nettle. It's nice, that, isn't it? It's a nice sensation. Lovely sensation. Love and uh, the afterburn. <sighs> oh God! There's some toilets at this campsite. Uh, book it and chuck it, mate. Oh, Jesus! Book it and chuck it. That's proper wild camping. Well, you've got your there, trowel with you. Got what? Your trowel. Oh yeah, I've got my trowel. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you could dig a hole that the big. The moisture wipes. Yeah, it'd have to be a, a big hole. A, a trench. A trench. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, again, let's get, let's get off that one. Right, onwards and upwards, David. Let us go. Oh. Yeah, so up to now we've accumulated the usual obligatory horsefly bites, uh, nettle stings, and other such creatures. And I'll just give you a little view of where we're walking, which is nice. I felt better after those cokes. I two, two uh, Pepsis. I was really flagging. I didn't realise, but Dave just said the section that we've just walked from, from Bonus on Solway, the, where the road starts, that is the longest section of the actual walk uh, on road so yeah that's done you don't really see it too much really to be honest with you uh, the estuary's there but you're quite a way off the beaten track so uh, I met some really nice people on the way so we'll catch up with you soon Coming up for the last push. We've come through that little kissing gate here, across that little bridge here, look. Oh yeah. And we're gonna walk Got over there. there. Right. Keep these trees. Yeah north of you so we're going to be on our left hand side and this is a part of the old wall here closely following the line of the wall so you'll see little Evans walking on muddy bridleway path edges so it's quite a way we're nearly there mate but Dave where's the pub the, the drovers is there can you see the drovers <laughs> drovers so we are, we are, we are let's here. get drove in then right I'm going to be brutally honest with you now, guys. I'm, you know, when I said I was going to do this with Dave, we want to give you warts and all on this, do. Unfortunately, I've had to get some moisturising elements, which are in my rucksack because I have no idea where the actual main moisturising element is, being Vaseline. And uh, let's just say it's in the nether regions. I'll leave it at that. Dave had to apply it for me, didn't you, mate? I was witness to uh, a very wet slurry of moisturising. Oh, <laughs> yeah, he was, actually. Heading south. Uh, it wasn't good to watch. <laughs> Anyway, I didn't have to watch. 
No, but you just wanted to do, didn't you? Just to have a laugh. Yeah, morbid curiosity, unfortunately. Yeah. But uh, yeah, it looked very swollen. <laughs> <clears throat> I think we're going to pass that way. Pub meal book for 6 30. So we'll get in there and sample the wares. What are you fancying, Dave? Apart oh, from? Well, yeah, I'll go for a steak if it's on the menu. Steak. I won't mind a steak. But a steak nice sounds good. A nice rare bread for chocolate would be just as good. Catch you soon, guys. Guys, we're at Roman Wall Cottages. Yeah, very quiet. So we're just going to try and set the Thames up. All right, guys, here we are. <laughs> Trover's rest, aren't we, Dave? <laughs> and um, we've just been presented with this. Uh, supposedly a, a Cumberland sausage hot dog. And. Uh, What's your general views then? <laughs> Personally, I think this is one of the worst meals I've ever <laughs> eaten in my life. Yeah. This is supposed to be homemade, home stuffed sausage, <laughs> Cumberland sausage. It's dry. It's only fit for one thing, that mate. Isn't it? Yeah, but, well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good. No, not good. Anyway, here we are. And uh, yes, the drovers, drovers rest. Hi guys, hope you're all well. <laughs> There's a bit of a pun to that one, but we won't go there. Dave is meandering. Uh, yeah. Um, gotta say, uh, we just had a meal at the Drover's Rest. Drover's Rest um, in Monkill, and I'll say no more. Anything to I say, Dave? I have nothing to say. It was probably the single worst. <sighs> meal. It was terrible. Ever eaten. Absolutely terrible. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're here, we're just back. It's about, I don't know, nine-ish or something like that. Um, and we're just chilling out and uh, it's been a great day. It's been a hard day. And we're just gonna go get some Zeds, aren't we, mate? I think Chill so, out. yeah. Chill out on the grass for a bit. Have a brew, maybe. Yeah, let's have a brew. Yeah. That's a good idea. I like that. Call them easily. <laughs> mugshot, I've got some mugshots. Mug. Yeah, let's have a mug show. Yeah. <laughs> See you later, guys. Thanks for watching. Some cloves. So, because cloves weigh a fucking ton, uh, water is going to be an issue. Um, I try not to. Pete, say hello, Pete. Hello, mate. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be on live on YouTube. Mate. All right. <laughs> You'll probably know me anyway. What's your know. YouTube channel, mate? Uh, the Outdoors and Me. Right, yeah. okay, cool. I've only got 78 subscribers at the moment. Well, I've only got about 130, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> as long as you enjoy doing it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you've got a few subscribers there, haven't you? No, I don't think so. No, no, I just no. put my videos on for sharing for friends and family, really. Anyway, yeah, here we fair. are. We've got a nice uh, cup of jar. We've got our friend Pete's coming over for chin wag, so we're just going to enjoy that and uh, crack on. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Here we are at the Roman Lodges, which was the first stop last night. Um, be honest with you, I didn't have a very good afternoon later on. Um, sun absolutely zapped me and completely drained, but managed to get some some kit last night. So we're gonna push through to Carlisle, Dave, now. Yeah, through to the next stage. <sighs> through to the next stage, and it's gonna be probably the warmest day in the year to now. Action man here is quite happy. Thank you, mate. <laughs> so yeah, lovely campsite though. If anybody's ever thinking of doing the 
walk. Cracking site, though, isn't it? Yeah, facilities are fantastic. Yeah, yeah got nice really good nice facilities. Bath. Yeah. Fantastic. The food's terrible at Drover's Rest. Oh, I, I mean, there's not a lot else you can do, really, is there? Bring, bring something to eat. Yeah, it's worth it. Because once you've tried that uh, Cumberland sausage. Special. Special. Which one? With chili dog on, I had with jalapenos. Then you, there's no looking back. <laughs> We've met a guy called Pete, who's uh, ex-medical. Oh, he's still in. in the, oh, no, he's still in, too. Yeah, he's med. He's a med in the army or the marines or whatever it is. He's a nice Top lad. And uh, he's going to push through to Carlisle as well. And uh, we'll catch up with you soon. Over and out.